<laughs> SpongeBob SquarePants, this time you took things too far. Well, well, well. His royal hiney finally decided to show up. This snail oil saleswoman broke into my royal bath time chamber and stole my bubble soap. She never posed any real danger until your can-do attitude enabled her. Do you have any idea how much power she'll wield once she has enough jelly? Silence! I am now the queen of the ocean, and with the power of the cosmic jelly, I will reshape the seas according to my wishes. <laughs> SpongeBob, I have tolerated your annoying little slip-ups for years now, but I have had it! Because of you, I have been kidnapped, I had to relearn to speak, and my toilet is clogged with jelly! Enough is enough! You know what? It's not that bad. I'll just get the plunger. You're going nowhere, my delicious little rage muffin. You have the perfect attitude to be my new pet. <laughs> this is it, Patrick. My wishes may have shaken up the world, but your father is the one who's gone out of control. It's time to stop it for good and save our friends once and for all. They look really cool while we do it. Patrick, stay close to me. Look over here, Spongebob. Oh, 
Oh, Squidward, I'm so glad you're back to normal. Yeah, what happened? And why does my mouth taste like jelly? I have to hand it to you, SpongeBob. Your quirky approach did what the Royal Guard failed to do. You apprehended Madame Cassandra. Of course, you also empowered her to nearly destroy us all. But that's jelly under the bridge now. <laughs> As a reward for your outstanding bravery, I shall grant you one final wish. So make it count. After today, there's only one thing I can wish for, and that is... That was fun! I wish we could do it all over again! Patrick, no! no!